Hey, good morning, everyone. Just want to give you the quick news story. Microsoft Xbox is going to be purchasing Activision Blizzard. So they're going to be the owners of Overwatch, Diablo, Call of Duty, World of Warcraft, Candy Crush, Starcraft, and more. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, Call, or I already said Call of Duty, uh, Crash Bandicoot, and Sparrow will now become Xbox exclusives unless they decide to let that game be multi-platform, which they should. But they just acquired a lot of development studios because I know they have Treyarch, Raven, uh, Beanox, uh, Toys for Bob, I guess who, wherever the Neversoft guys were. I know some of them are still with them. Uh, High Moon, uh, Blizzard, Infinity Ward, Sledgehammer Games, Demonware, and um, I think that's all of them. I'm sure I'm missing one somewhere. Um, but wow, uh, that that's a, that's going to set them back a pretty, pretty pity. I'm curious to see how much that costs. If um, that's going to be definitely probably over ten billion, easy guess. Um, but yeah, that's that's crazy that uh, Activision Games will now become Xbox exclusives at some point. Um, I guarantee they're doing this for Game Pass. Uh, maybe they'll get to, maybe they'll put their games back on Steam. That'd be cool. Uh, but <laughs> by doing this, X, uh, Microsoft will have two gaming stores on PC. They'll have Windows Store and um, Battle.net. So wow. Um, didn't see that one coming. Uh, that's definitely going to leave a dent in PlayStation's library. So Sony, I'm <laughs> watch the the buy Take Two or Rockstar to get Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> um, if there's a chance for them to get Crash Bandicoot inspired, they need to do it now. Otherwise, those are going to be gone from PlayStation forever. Um, yeah, I'd love to hear your comments on this one. This is a definitely. Uh, uh, something I want to talk about. This was just announced 15 minutes ago, according to the Xbox feed that I'm reading. So it's 7:45 a.m. where I'm at. Um, yeah, wow. Um, I've been playing Activision games since the Nintendo 64 PS1 days, and never thought they of all companies uh, would go, uh, you know, be purchased. Um, I can see why they're doing this uh, with all the backlash that they're getting right now. This was probably a perfect opportunity for Microsoft mm -hmm. to swoop in and get them. So, yeah, anyone, um, show those comments.